What is going on, football fans? So the New York Giants just made their second selection in the fifth round, their compensation pick, um, the 33rd pick in the fifth round, um, in getting wide receiver from Auburn, Darius Slayton. Now, Slayton hasn't been super productive throughout his collegiate career. Um, last year, he had 35 catches for just under 700 yards, I think five touchdowns, which was tied for the team lead. The Auburn offense wasn't great this year. Um, but Slayton has some potential, there's no doubt about it. He is a former track star, and that is his best attribute. He is a burner. He ran a 4.3940 at the Combine, um, and he's the type of receiver who could potentially take the top off of a defense. Everything I read is route running is average. It's not bad. Uh, very fast. But um, he struggles um, breaking coverage, and he drops some balls. But very explosive. Um, the Giants certainly could use a wide receiver like this. Who knows? Maybe he'll be effective in the special teams. Who knows? But the, I either wanted a wide receiver like this or a red zone target, a tall six foot five receiver. But this definitely adds a different element to the receiving core. Um, and I think it's a good pick. It sounds like this guy's a flyer, but that's what you want late in the, late in the draft. You want guys with high high potential. Um, and, you know, he's boom or bust. But I like the pick here. I mean, you can't really go wrong here. A guy with speed like that, he's definitely worth a flyer this late in the draft. Um, you know, they could have went with a few other guys. They continue to ignore the offensive tackle, which... Uh, you know, befuddles me, but at this point, we'll see. They got three more picks left. We'll see if they take an offensive tackle at all in this draft. I think they have to at some point. But, um, yeah, they go out, they get a wide receiver, a burner, take the top off a of defense, similar to, like, a Deshaun Jackson-type receiver, Tyree Kill. You hope he could have a role like that. Not saying he'll ever be as good as those guys, but, you know, it's always good to have a deep threat like that that could take the top off the defense, could open up, open up, you know, for the rest of the wide receivers. Um, so... I like the pick. Why not? You know, high upside, and we'll see where it goes. But as always, if you liked what you watched, please subscribe. Drop a comment. Maybe give me a little thumbs up. Tell me your thoughts in the comments below. What do you think about this selection? Cheers.